Hello, this is Scott, and this is our Hyper Report for January 12, 2012. Here are the prices for various items such as gold, silver, and oil for today. First, Iran Russia dumped dollar for royal ruble. Russia's strong opposition to sanctions against Iran is paying dividends for their country with new agreements with Iran. The agreed switching to national currencies instead of the dollar for trade transactions will accelerate the dollar being dumped as the world reserve currency. Next, Greek crisis dries up drug supply. In a preview of events that will hit the U.S., medications like aspirin are now hard to come by in crisis-stricken Greece. Needless to say, the socialized medical care situation in that country is going downhill fast. In short, stock up on the basic medical supplies now. Next, the U.S. debt ceiling theater is back. In less than five short months, the U.S. is again at the debt ceiling. The Treasury is, yet again, ready to implement extraordinary measures in the form of rating or borrowing from federal pension funds. In other words, chairs are being set up for the music. Hmm. Basically what he's saying is, they bought the borrow billions again <clears throat> and, and create money out of thin air. You people better, you people better vote for Ron Paul, bro. <clears throat> China dump your dollar, Russia dump the dollar, India dump the dollar. It, it ain't the dollar, the dollar is worthless, literally worthless. That's why you see the price of gold is nearly $2,000 ounce. That, 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 don't, that don't means gold is going up. That means the dollar is coming, the dollar is decreasing, bro. So, 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 uh, th this is what's happening. You know what I mean? The, how you could borrow money from, from nothing, nothing from nothing, make nothing. So it's just the illusion they setting up here. And then who, who, who pick up the debt? Hmm. The, your all children. Your all children's children. Be paying debt for the rest of your life. Being set up for the music. Next, six million households have only <coughs> five day savings. In the UK, which most likely reflects the similar situation in the US, millions of households have about five days worth or 250 in savings. The question is, is it in the bank? If so, they may have no savings if there is a bank holiday. At any rate, it is a good idea to have at a minimum six months of savings set aside for a rainy day. Next, Romney will... And you know what is a bank holiday, nigga? Uh, a bank holiday is when the bank closed the doors to y'all people. Y'all don't but take that money out of the bank. Invest in some silver. Invest in a little piece of gold. Why didn't the, the, the white man downtown now but cash for gold? <clears throat> Because they know gold can be the only thing that have value soon to come. So you people better just invest in silver. If you can't afford gold while silver cheap, try to get some stocks of that. And provokes desperation play. Goldman Sachs backed Romney may have won New Hampshire. However, it was a dismal showing. Ron Paul, who came in second, beat all of the other Romney wannabes combined. As more and more people listen to Ron Paul, they are beginning to see the other candidates, including Romney, as a bunch of hacks that have nothing to offer. Including... Man, Ron Paul is your only hope. Y'all don't have no other hope but Ron Paul, you know, and I doubt, I, I mean, I really, 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 really want Ron Paul to win, but I doubt he can win, because America controlled by the Queen, by Britain, they call the shots, these people are puppets, you know, the people have to actually uprise and put Ron Paul into power if they want him in power, because if you all trust them election shit, dying awake. It's the same thing all over the world. Anybody you see the queen them, Britain them off the hand and something the queen them, then you're going to have a problem, bro. You see what they do with Kennedy. All of, all of, all of the family them, all of them presidents was the queen cousin. So, just a bunch of shit, man. So, if Ron Paul win, it's a miracle. And if he win, I think, I hope he ain't no puppet, slave to the rhythm, you know. Try help America, because you all need it desperately. Centaurum who finished fifth. Keep your eyes on the Republican and media elite. They are terrified of the 77 year old doctor. Next, Chinese ammunition. Disarming Americans one gun at a time. First it was baby formula, then pet food, now it's bullets made in China. One user test fired a gun made with these Chinese made bullets. The gun was destroyed when the bullet exploded, causing adjacent bullets to explode in the chamber. We what, you all, what, what, what else do you all expect for the China? What else do you expect? China is a country with plenty of people. They just will make anything insanity up, bro. They don't care. And how you how you could how you could work with people like them and buy them from them when these people just eat fucking dog and cat. You are what you eat, so that's how they thinking, like a dog and like a cat. So 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 China. All y'all doing, yeah. 
exactly where these things are made before buying. Your life depends on it. Next, Obama's DNC speech could move to Bank of America Stadium. Showing how in bed Obama is with big bankers, he is planning his Democratic National Committee speech to be in the current Bank of America 74,000 seat stadium. Hell, why doesn't he just televise it from the Bank of America boardroom with Sugar Daddy Bernanke sitting next to him? The Miss Lay, I know some <coughs> Obama when he have dark color skin. Obama is not a Negro. Alright? I repeat, Obama is not a Negro. Obama is a Hamite. Okay? He's the Ishmaelite. Mix mix up with the Edomites. He is not a Hebrew Israelite. He's not a black Hebrew. He's a he's a he's a West African Dirt Monger pig. Okay, and we don't we, we don't accept him and we don't embrace him as one of us. <clears throat> all right, so just get that piece clear. So if you all crack us and unknowing Negroes. Next, TSA officers jailed for stealing forty thousand dollars in cash from passengers' bag. Two TSA thugs or officers pleaded guilty to stealing nearly forty thousand dollars from a passenger's bag. Hopefully, they will be placed into the general population in prison where they will get their own personalized TSA-like screenings. Well, I think most of the TSA officers block in the United States. That's the plan there. Use them like they're giving them job, knowing that they can, they can do a little bit of teething and then rush them straight to jail. That's the way they get rid of the black man too. And that's good for them Negroes because they ain't been up in them people's system anyhow. Since you won't be a part of the system, then you be a part of the system. Now how I'd feel you can be getting groped in jail now. Huh? Okay then, stupid. Don't 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 partake in America fuckery, yeah? Finally, please prepare now for the escalating economic and social unrest. Good day.